I'm Nancy Ola on eHow.com. Today, we're going to make a yummy vegetarian chicken piccata without the chicken. That's right, this is a dish that even the meat eaters in your family are going to love and have wondering how you made it. First, we're going to dredge vegetarian chicken cutlets in seasoned flour and put them in a hot pan. So in just two to three minutes on each side, my cutlets are cooked. I'm going to be taking them out of my hot pan and letting them rest on a separate plate. Meanwhile, I'm going to go back and put in four to five minced shallots. Saute them and start picking up all the different little bits of goodness that are in this pan. So after my shallots have cooked for a few minutes, I'm going to add about a half a cup of wine to deglaze the pan. Now deglaze is just a fancy French word for using a liquid in your pan to pick up all the little bits and pieces of goodness that are there. Now normally if you were using chicken, you would be picking up the fat and some of the meat from the chicken. But here, we're using a vegetarian chicken cutlet, so we don't have quite those same things to be picking up. While that's cooking down, I've got lemon juice, lemon that I've zested, about four tablespoons of capers, and three tablespoons of parsley, and two tablespoons of butter, and that's all I need to finish off my sauce. As this cooks down, the sauce is going to start getting thick. When the volume of wine is reduced by about half, you're going to add in the juice of one lemon, the lemon zest that you carefully zested from your lemon, and your capers. Cook that for just another minute, and then add two tablespoons of softened butter. Once the butter's melted, we're going to go ahead and return the cutlets to the pan, saute them just briefly on both sides so that they absorb all the sauce, and you will have a delicious meatless chicken piccata. Add a little pepper and sea salt. sauce is looking and smelling wonderful. Add my chicken back to the pan. Give it a turn so that both sides have absorbed the sauce. and then garnish it with parsley. That's my vegetarian chicken piccata recipe. I think it's a yummy dish for meat eaters, and I hope your family enjoys it. I'm Nancy Ola, and thanks for watching at eHow.com.